read with you Here Comes Winter. This is a first start easy reader. There's the title page of this book. What do you see on the title page of this book? Do you see a bag? What do you see in that bag? What do you think these things have to do with winter? Some special fabric and a zipper. Hmm. Let's read the book, Here Comes Winter, and find out what they have to do with winter. Brr. Winter. Is winter coming? Who is this main character in this book? The main character in this book is a rabbit. When you look at this picture and see these curtains, and you see the rabbit on this side of the curtains, and the window on the other side of the curtains, that can help you figure out the setting of this book. What do you think is the setting? Where is the rabbit at right now in the story? I think the rabbit is inside his house and look, the window is a little bit open, but he's pulling it closed because little snowflakes are falling into his house. And he says, Burr, is winter coming? And what's the answer to his question, is winter coming? I think winter has already gotten there, yes. Let's look at this main character. They're going to introduce the main character to us and tell us that main character's name. Burr, says Billy. Winter is coming. I will get ready. So what is the main character's name? This rabbit is the main character of this book. And his name is Billy. And when we see these little quotation marks before what he says, and little quotation marks after what he says, we know that burr is exactly what Billy said. And winter is coming. I will get ready is inside quotation marks. So we know that's exactly what Billy the rabbit said. So what did Billy the rabbit start to do when he saw that winter was coming? He went to put on his shoes. Do those look like flip-flops or boots? Yeah, I think those are warm, cozy boots. Billy gets busy. He gets a bag. A special shopping bag. Oh, so where is Billy going? Billy is going shopping. I wonder what Billy will buy. What will Billy get? Slam. <laughs> Billy closed the door to his house. And what are these right here? Those are Billy's paw prints where he's hopping through the snow. And then we can't see them down here for a while. And then there they come again, Billy's paw prints. As he's hopping through the snow. Let's look where Billy went. Hip hop into the store goes Billy. So where did Billy go? He's going to the store. I wonder what they sell at that store. Oh, look, there's more quotation marks. 
So we know Billy's gonna talk. And look, here's Billy, our main character. And so if Billy's talking, can we see the person Billy's talking to in this picture? If he just went into a store, who do you think he's gonna be talking to when we read what's in between these quotation marks? Let's find out if you're right. Do you have any buttons? Says Billy. Hmm. Wonder why he needs buttons. I wonder who he's talking to. Oh, look, it shows us who he's talking to. Yes, says Millie. I have lots of buttons. Big buttons, little buttons, pretty buttons, special buttons. We know that was Millie talking, and those are the exact words she said because we see these quotation marks. Now let's look at these buttons. So Billy has gone into a store and he asked Millie. Why do you think he asked Millie if she had buttons? I think it's because she works at the store. So she would know. And so she showed him all of those buttons that she has. I wonder what Billy wants buttons for. Which button do you think Billy will choose? Good, says Billy. I will get three pretty buttons. What do you think Billy's going to use three pretty buttons for? Look, he's holding up his three fingers. One, two, three. Can you hold up three fingers like Billy is? One, two, three. I wonder what he's going to do with those three pretty buttons. One... Two, three, into the bag go three pretty buttons. Oh, what color buttons did he choose? He chose the white buttons. Hip, hop, away goes Billy. Where is he leaving from? He's leaving one store. See the bell that's ringing when he leaves to tell the, the employee that he has left the store? Where do you think he'll hop to next? Huh. Into the store goes Billy. What will he get? Look, I wonder what kind of store this is that Billy's going into. He's gone inside a different store. Let's see what Billy gets in the next store. Now he bought buttons at his first store. Let's see what Billy buys at this store. Do you have any cloth? Says Billy. Do you see what there is before and after what Billy said? There are quotation marks before his words. And there are quotation marks after his words, showing that those are the exact words that Billy said. Uh, yes, says Willie. Here's Willie that works at the fabric store. I have lots of cloth. Big cloth, little cloth, pretty cloth, special cloth. Why do you think that Billy wants to buy cloth from Willie at the fabric store? Which one of these cloths do you think Billy will choose? I really like this one over here with these pretty paisley prints on it. I wonder what Billy will choose. Good says Billy. I will get special cloth. Oh, Billy chose the blue one. That looks like some, ooh, 
some really thick cloth right there. And it looks like maybe these lines mean that it's furry. So he chose the special cloth that's blue. Into the bag goes the special cloth Hip hop, away goes Billy. Into the store goes Billy. Do you have any zippers, says Billy. So what did Billy buy first at the first store? He bought three what? Three buttons. And what did Billy buy at the second store? Special cloth. And what is Billy asking for at this third store? Zippers. Zippers. Hmm. What is Billy going to do with three buttons, special cloth, and zippers? You think they have zippers at this store? Yes, says Tilly. I have lots of zippers. Look at all those zippers that Tilly has. Big zippers, little zippers, pretty zippers, special zippers. Look at Tilly showing him all of those different zippers. Which zipper do you think Billy the bunny will choose? says Billy. I will get this big zipper. Look at that big zipper that Billy chose. So at the first store, he bought three buttons. At the second store, he bought special cloth. At the third store, he's buying a big zipper. What do you think the main character, Billy, is going to do with all of those things? Let's see if the book will tell us. Into the bag goes the zipper. Hip hop, away goes Billy. Where do you think Billy is going now? Good, says Billy. The shopping bag is full. We know that's what Billy said because we see the quotation marks around it. And then it tells us who's talking. And then we see more quotation marks telling us he's talking. There's his full bag. So where did he go? He's back home now. Billy gets busy. What will Billy make? Do you have a prediction? Can you predict what you think Billy will make with the things he bought at the stores? What did he get? What supplies or tools did he get at home? Let's see what Billy will make. He gets the special cloth. Snip, snip. What does it say, snip, snip? What is he doing? He's cutting. He gets the big zipper. Zip, zip. Mm. On go the buttons. One, two, three. What will Billy make? Have you figured out what Billy is making? A new coat. Do you need a coat in the winter time? Brr. Winter is coming. See Billy hopping? He's hopping. Hop, hop, hop. Winter is coming. But Billy is ready in his new coat. Did you predict correctly what Billy would make with the things he was buying? I hope you enjoyed reading Here Comes Winter about Billy and his new coat.
I hope you'll come back for more read-alouds.